Here are seven tips and tricks for your Google Pixel 7 Pro. Under four minutes. Plus, there is a bonus tip at the end of this video, so make sure you stick around. Hey there, it's me, Martijn, and let's get started. Number one, full resolution. The Pixel 8 pixels are not fully utilized. It is set to 1080p out of the box, while your phone supports a 1440p resolution. Go to settings, down to display, and almost at the bottom you can fix that. Number two, quick tap. One of my favorite features is to tap twice on the back to enable a certain feature, and in my case that is the torch. But there is a whole set of others as well. To set it up, go to settings, scroll down and tap on system, gestures, and then quick tap. Here's the full list, plus the option to enable stronger taps to avoid accidental ones. Number three, hotshot. This is Google's alternative to Apple's live photo. In essence, it records a short video and then you can select the best possible image from it. Or let Google do a suggestion. It is set to auto by default, so if you want to turn it on all the time, go to the camera settings and press this icon over here. Number four, erase. I love to make my photos look as clean and minimal as possible, but sometimes there are either some unwanted people or objects in it. With Google's new erase feature, it is easier than ever before to remove some pixels from your pictures. I've taken this picture and by going to the edit section and under tools we find this erase option. It doesn't always work perfect, but comes in pretty handy at times. Number five save folder. Some pictures are a bit more intimate or you have documents that aren't for the public, then save folder comes in super handy. You can hide files in your save folder and control access with a pin. Definitely something you want to set up on day one. Number 5.2, automatically save your pictures to the save folder. Once you've set it up, you can easily and automatically save for example new pictures automatically to the save folder. Open the camera app, Hold down the cover photo to go to the album and set it to locked folder. All your pictures taken will be saved straight into the locked folder. Number six, power button remap. If you don't like the assistant popping up when holding down the power button, you have to remap the power button. For example, I want to get the emergency services on the phone quickly whenever it's needed and I don't want to press some sort of strange combination of volume and power button. To do so, go to settings, then system, followed by gestures, and then all the way at the bottom, I disabled this. Number seven, now playing. If you constantly want to know what song is playing, for example, if you're at a festival, then this tool is magic. If you want to enable this, go to settings once again, and then search for now playing. It will show you the name of the artist of the songs playing nearby on your lock screen and always on display. And here's the bonus tip, protect your Google Pixel. So this phone is super slippery and you definitely want to put a case around it. I've put a thick and strong Spigen case around it, but there are so many good alternatives available that I've left a link for you in the video description to check it out. I've shared my seven tips and tricks with you, but I'm really curious what is your favorite one? Let us know in the comments below. Or check out this video over here where I share my top five privacy tips and tricks. Anyways, thank you so much for watching this video and please subscribe so that I see you in the next one.